Pickham was the starter one year ago. Pickham will hand it off. The tie shot. Great play by Devin Gill and Devin Bush here on this uh, run play for Maryland. You're going to notice Maryland's offensive line blocks down to the right, and then this guard is going to pull to pick up Winovich on the edge. Maryland will have two lead blockers out here uh, to um, lead the way for this outside run uh, on this handoff. Um, you know, I think they underestimate the speed of Michigan's linebackers since both these outside uh, blockers here are, are kind of sealing the edge. It seems like this guy probably should have bubbled around these blockers, but uh, there's this lane for both uh, Gill and Bush to crash down, so it seems like that's a missed block uh, here. Bonus points for Kinnell for avoiding that first block. Um, and really this play is made by the uh, anticipation from Gill. Gill was over here, and then right at the snap at the time of the handoff, Gill's already anticipating this play, and he's already getting that angle uh, to the outside of the play. Uh, you know, Bush is here. I think he probably, Bush is responsible for the quarterback if he does keep here, because uh, I think this run is designed to go off the butt of this uh, guard if he does keep. I'm not sure if it's a true read option here, but, uh, you know, given that he does hand it off, now you see them both uh, cutting to the ball carrier and doing a really good job of tracking him down. Hill back in there to throw. Under pressure! Can nice blitz from Dwum in Hudson here. Uh, notice first how Michigan's bringing uh, three linebackers as well as the three defensive linemen to kind of confuse the offensive line and show a unique pressure look. Um, let's first look at the routes, though. All the routes seem to be uh, kind of outside medium uh, to longer developing routes. Um, nothing really comes open uh, for Maryland, at least not at the point that uh, he's feeling pressure. So you can see everyone's pretty locked up. No one's uh, coming across the middle or any quick outlets for uh, the Maryland QB. So uh, he's in trouble here. Let's look at the pressure now uh, for Michigan. Uh, Michigan brings five initially with Bush. Uh, has his eyes on 24 here. He's responsible for keeping, uh, you know, for guarding the running back if he goes out in any routes here. So, um, you know, Maryland does an, a pretty good job initially. You can see this pocket is held pretty well. A um, couple things to look at, though. Hudson will come off of this running back block and come inside uh, to get pressure. This center was blocking Dwum 4 here, but you can see Dwum 4 start to get free. This center, for whatever reason, decides to try to help this uh, this guard here on pay. That opens up this lane that you see right off of the butt of this center for Dwum 4 to actually get pressure. So, you know, it's a good play by Michigan, but overall, uh, it's more of uh, some blocking miscues by Maryland. The play! And more fun from the Maryland offense. Here's to Sean Hill. And he's going to be... Another blitz for Michigan yields another sack. Uh, let's look at the blocking from Maryland first. It's the same kind of jet sweep action. So all these linemen will pull or will block down as well as this tight end. Uh, this guard is going to pull to pick up the tight end on the side. And then you have this kind of action where you got two blockers in this jet sweep. It's play action though. So play action pass. But that's kind of what you get. Um, I want you to focus on Hudson right here. He is going to be waiting for this uh, tight end to be engaged with Hutchinson before he blitzes off the edge. That hesitation is going to leave no one on the edge to block him. Notice he's waiting. He's waiting right now. Okay, number 82 is engaged. Now he's going to come off the edge. That hesitation leaves him unblocked and gives him a lot of space around the edge here. Notice now that this is the only unblocked guy and he has to deal with a blitzing linebacker uh, off the edge. That's just not going to happen. Um, I do think that uh, Maryland had something here with number 17 on this uh, kind of this post route quick crossing pattern. Uh, I think right here, right now, you can see Devin Bush has his eyes elsewhere. It looks like this route is coming open. You know, you do have Kinnell reading the quarterback's eyes and he is flowing over to this route. Um, but it does look like he's looking into this direction for this route. I don't know why he hesitated. You know, if the ball were out now, it looks like this would have been a, a pretty good option for him to go. Uh, instead, he holds onto the ball and, uh, you know, obviously gets sacked as a result. And, you know, I think that was his only option. You look elsewhere on the field, I don't see any other, any other, um, you know, busts and coverage. It looks like, you know, there's a defender over top plus Hills all over this guy. Um, you know, you got Metellus, you got Ross on this guy. And by that time, he's the quarterback's already feeling the pressure. So good coverage, good blitz, and, um, you know, good play. <laughs> 
Oh, it looks like they might have wanted to run that. Broken play from Maryland gives a big tackle for loss for uh, Josh Uche here off the edge. So you notice this mesh point. Uh, it, it really looks like uh, it was trying to be a, uh, a jet sweep here. You know, this the ball looks like it just didn't get to the receiver. Maybe the snap was a second late. As a result, um, you know, you're going to see right away this wide receiver is looking back at the quarterback like, whoops, that's not supposed to happen. Um, you know, two blockers for Maryland getting out to the outside here, and they kind of let Josh Uche inside because, yeah, they think this wide receiver is, is the one who has the ball, and, you know, that should be plenty of room for him, uh, for anyone that comes inside. Uh, and it actually does seem to be like a pretty well set up play here you know given that Uche takes himself out of the play by rushing up field wide receiver does have the ball you know you have hill accounted for out here you have long accounted for out here and then you have one more blocker for uh, any free-flowing safety so it looks like the play was uh, you know in general pretty well set up it just the handoff wasn't there regardless of that it's a really good play from josh Uche, and it shows his athleticism so, you know, he, he makes this move to cut inside. He bends really low and then kind of explodes out of that bend and shows off some really good acceleration and, and um, really an, an agility to turn that quick. Um, he seems a little too quick for someone that size. It's kind of freaky, but good play. This is the pick six play for Watson. I don't have the original broadcast because uh, I believe there was like a news update or something terrible. Um, so that sucks, but good play from Watson here uh, for pick six. Michigan initially sends five on pressure. Um, you know, Maryland does a pretty good job to actually pick this up. You're, you will have Ross coming late on this left side, um, but at that point, um, you know, the ball's already on its way out. You will see Dwum Four kind of getting pressure late, but he's not really in the face of the quarterback, so it's... You know, he has he's stepping back, but he has plenty of time here, it seems like. Um, as far as the routes go, you're going to have a shallow cross, and then you had a slant and a deeper slant, and, you know, that kind of creates this mesh point, and I think that's why this first read w was on this slant, because he's expecting these uh, slant routes to kind of create some chaos for this defender. Um, you know, it doesn't end up that way. I do think the best option... Uh, for him here was uh, this deeper uh, crossing route. You can see now, you know, off of the initial slant, he makes another cut here, and Metellus is kind of caught out of position. Um, so it looks like he has some space. You know, safety wasn't up on um, up on this route right here. So if he were to throw here uh, instead of you know over to here, it seems like he would have had something. Obviously, he doesn't. Results in a pick. Uh, really good job by Watson here. Um, just keeping his eyes good position in, in the hip pocket of the wide receiver and uh, takes it all the way.